Hi, this is Avni Bharti and welcome to another episode of TFR Newsroom. And today we have with us once again, David Van Avern, SVP of Marketing and Mirantis. David, you are organizing uh, uh, Mirantis's own event and it's, it's going to be virtual. So it's a first event, but it's virtual. So tell us a bit about the event itself. Yeah, I'm ex extremely proud to announce that Mirantis is launching the Launchpad Conference, our inaugural event. Uh, it's open to the entire public. It'll happen on September 16th, starting at 8 a.m. Pacific. And uh, we're really excited to use this as an opportunity to connect with the cloud native community and people that are interested in learning and discussing more about container technology, Kubernetes, uh, some exciting new technology trends and to hear from some of the Mirantis customers that have been working in the container space for quite a while. Uh, you, you're calling it Launchpad 2020. <laughs> what's, the, what's in the name? Yeah, well, we have several surprises in store for the attendees. We'll definitely be making some product announcements. And uh, so those will be the launch of uh, an entirely new offering based on Docker Enterprise that we think is going to generate uh, quite a bit of excitement in our industry and uh, show some of the innovation that we've been working on for the, the past nine or 10 months. This is first of all first event, and we, you know, this is a kind of different, you know, uh, uh, scenario we are looking at. You know, things are moving to virtual. We are moving away from physical events to virtual event. So, why are you trying to do it now? Why don't you want to wait next year when we can still do things in person? We've been very successful in organizing and co-organizing several events with industry partners, and um, we've found that. Uh, these are turning into a, a fantastic way of connecting with a broader audience. Uh, we're seeing that uh, the level of engagement can actually be quite good as long as uh, you know we do our part in providing content that's interesting and informative and helpful for people. They'll make time out of their days to uh, attend those sessions. The sessions that we'll be hosting will be running live, but at the same time, if people need to catch up a little, a little bit later, uh, they'll have the opportunity to do that by watching the recorded session. So that uh, virtual format really allows for a lot more flexibility, which we can all really benefit from these days. As you were talking about earlier events, and we, we talked about them earlier, and it was kind of unprecedented audience that you saw, you were not expecting the, the kind of people who showed up for the virtual event. So uh, first of all, who will be attending the, the event and what kind of turnout you're expecting here? We're expecting a huge turnout. So uh, we've had thousands of people register already for the event and uh, many of them are um, throughout, the, throughout the globe. Uh, there is perhaps a, a greater emphasis in North America because of the time zone, but we expect that uh, as the recordings become available, more people outside of the North American time zones will also uh, you know, attend and view some of the sessions. Uh, we're, we're seeing that uh, it's not only Mirantis customers, but also um, you know, plenty of folks throughout the industry in a variety of roles, everyone from IT operations through uh, DevOps, SREs, and software developers. Uh, what are some of the key highlights of the event? The key highlight is going to be the announcement of the new product uh, that is based on Docker Enterprise. And so if you check, it, check the agenda, you'll see a few uh, Easter eggs related to that product announcement where uh, we're tipping our hand a little bit, but um, you know, stay tuned for a lot more exciting information about that new product. That'll be uh, announced right at the beginning of the event by our CEO, Adrian Ionel. And then we'll be demonstrating the new product as well as some of the other new technologies that we're working with, like Lens, the Kubernetes IDE. Um, and so we'll be highlighting both of those technologies together in uh, demo sessions early on. Uh, the new product will then be featured in an in-depth track where we'll actually be providing 
much greater detail for several hours about that new product that we're launching. And alongside that track content will be two tracks focused on topics for developers and topics for operators. We'll talk about the Lens Roadmap and uh, some of the capabilities that are on, on track for uh, the next release, next major release of Lens. And we'll be uh, having several customers talk about their use cases, some of the benefits that they've seen from using the Docker Enterprise technology and um, you know some of some of the things that they they want to do next, right? So where where they're looking to take containers and Kubernetes in their own um, application moderate modernization journey. Can you also talk about you know uh, how people can uh, kind of attend the event? What platform are you using for people to access it? It's very easy to use. Uh, so we're using the same platform that was used by DockerCon, which was held earlier this year and was an extremely successful virtual event. Uh, so we'll be using the same platform. It's very easy to navigate from, directly from the event agenda to an individual session, um, whether that's uh, during the event or afterwards. Uh, the website will be available uh, for 60 days post-event, so plenty of time to check in and, and view all of the content that you maybe weren't able to get to right away. Um, all you need to do is visit mirantis.com slash launchpad event. And once you go there, you'll be taken to our event website and uh, you can register for the event there and uh, add it to your calendar, add individual sessions to your calendar. And um, yeah, we're looking forward to seeing everyone on September 16th at 8 a.m. Pacific. Thank you, uh, Dave, uh, for, uh, for talking about the event. And I personally am looking forward to attending it. Thank you. Thank you, as always.